This morning, veterinarians in the Midwest are warning pet owners about a dangerous flu outbreak. A new strain has killed six dogs and sickened more than a thousand in four states. Dean Reynolds shows us the effort to contain this highly contagious virus. Well behaved. He is, he is a great dog. Brittany Siciliano is the proud owner of three-month-old Franklin. Better be safe than Just sorry. Yep. Franklin isn't sick, but Brittany isn't taking any chances. There's no vaccine for this particular outbreak called H3N2, but on Wednesday she brought him in for a regular flu vaccine, hoping it will help keep him healthy. Yes. Okay, good. The new flu has never been diagnosed in the U.S. until now. <coughs> Symptoms include persistent coughing, runny nose, and fever. It's from China and South Korea. Dr. Natalie Marks is a co-owner of the Blum Animal Hospital in Chicago. She says dogs' immune systems aren't prepared to fight this virus, which has already killed six. Our dogs are getting sick, and they're getting sick quickly. And because it's so contagious, it's spreading rampantly throughout the city and unfortunately now to other states. In addition to Illinois, there have been cases in Wisconsin, Indiana, and Georgia. <laughs> Lulu was one of nearly 1,100 dogs in the Chicago area to become sick with the respiratory disease. The tiny French bulldog, who was treated in isolation, is now on the mend. For CBS This Morning, Dean Reynolds, Chicago. <laughs> I'm glad Lulu's on the men. It's a very yeah. serious thing. I've been hearing about this on the radio.